Last year I was involved in a charity event where we raised money for hostels for homeless people. It was quite fun. It was a, I think, 18 storey building and we had to abs abseil off the top of it. Um, I'm not sure if you know what abseiling is, but you basically jump off the top with a rope and then keep jumping until you hit the bottom. A lot of people were quite frightened, but they, they really enjoyed it as well. And so did I. I'd been reading a lot about um, young students, like pupils that weren't, you know, getting the support they needed, like um, with, with their reading. And so I was particularly moved to do something to, to help with that. And I found out about a charity called Book Time which allowed people to give up some of their time to go to a school and read with a child that wouldn't have that support at home. So, you know, in a way, I, I, I felt that, you know, I was giving up more than just my time. It, it, for me, it was nothing. It was enjoyable and I felt it was doing something for them as well. I don't really donate to charity on a regular basis, but I find that, particularly in winter, um, I get really upset by homeless people that I see on the streets, and I just think how lucky I am, and, and that's the time of year that I always try and donate just a little bit of money, and, and I hope that that improves people's lives in a small way. When um, I was in my teens, actually, I saw the pictures on television of the famine in Ethiopia. I was completely shocked. Um, I suppose everyone was. Um, I had been brought up in Malawi and had only come to Britain a few years earlier so I was, um, I think I was more devastated because the children looked like my friends. I did a lot of ice skating at that time and I decided to um, organise a sports aid event and I approached the ice rink and they were very happy as you can imagine and um, I put together all the sponsor sheets and uh, contacted the local newspaper and they came along and took a photograph of all the ice skaters and um, the local radio station came and interviewed me and um, we raised uh, over a thousand pounds so I was very pleased with that. A charity I was moved to give to is Dementia UK because my father has dementia and um, I wanted to support the charity to help other people um, in the future and hopefully they'll, they'll find some way to combat this. So that's why I was moved to do it. 